Hey guys, so in today's video, I am going to be ranking different lounge sets, different lounge sets, and I want to try to get the best deal for them, of course, that's what I try to focus on in my channel, try to get the best deals for, you know, everyday things, and just also try to look cute and like cute things combined with the best deals, and just nice cozy things that everybody enjoys, and I enjoy those a lot. So I have two different bags. One of them is from um, Timu, and I have two different lounge sets from Timu. And then I've had this set from Amazon, and I've probably had that for about a month. So I'm going to compare between Amazon and Timu, and I'm going to give you my review, and I'm going to say in my opinion who did it better. For the Amazon, I paid about maybe $20, $25 max. For the Tumu, I probably paid probably a little more, but soon as I got probably, I got basically two outfits for the same price as Amazon. I'm gonna see if it's still, you know, any better than Amazon, the quality. So we're gonna transition to me having the one from Amazon on first. All right, so this is the lounge set from Amazon, and both sets from Amazon and Timu, they're going to be long sleeve, and the bottoms are long. This one is very comfortable. It's lightweight. It's, like, perfect for just not wanting something that's too thick. It's just something lightweight, like I said. It's, um, I love this color because it's like a Duke Plum has more of a darker color, which I prefer that. The only critic critique I would say for these, for this set, is so like the bottom, I can't really see, but okay, so it's tapered down there. I prefer to have them kind of like flare at the bottom. And I was trying to find something that had a flare bottom on Timu and I kept looking and looking I think one of the sets in that bag might be flare but I'm not 100% sure I don't remember but other than that if the bottoms on these were flare I definitely would prefer this one over the ones that I got at Timu but we're gonna change I'm gonna change it to the Timu and then we'll see how it looks and I will tell you my honest thoughts Alright, so this is one of the lounge sets from Timu, and I will say I do like the style of the fabric. I do like just the way it looks, and the pants are definitely feel really nice. They do come with pockets, which is nice, plus that I did not get with Amazon set. And then it has the, I can't tell what it says right here at the very front, I don't know. But it looks cute in my opinion and has a little bee, has a bee neck. And then another plus with this set from Chimu is so at the bottom, as I said, they're flared. They're not going to be like tight around your ankles, which I hate that. Now the only thing I could really say that I don't like about this set from Chimu, and this is just with tops in general. So I hate it when like the outside is soft, like this is soft. But I don't like it when the inside is like a rougher, not as soft fabric that they like put on the outside. I don't like that. So I would say if they put this fabric on the inside, then I would say this set is practically perfect. And also, if any of you want to know my measurements, basically I usually get everything in a large. I get the top in a large. I get the pants in a large. So. I'm going to say just for the fact that I like the way it looks, the material is nice even though it's not the same material on the inside for a top, I still like how it feels. And then it has the pockets and it's flare at the bottom so just for that I'm going to say I like this outfit more than the one for Amazon. I still have one more 
lounge outfit from Tmail and we're gonna change it to that one, see if I might buy one even more than this one. All right, so this is the second set, second lounge set from Tmail. And this one, I will say was a little bit more difficult than the other one that I got from Tmail because, so the bottoms, they don't have like a tag that's like on the back. They don't have a tag basically like that. So all there was was just a tag on the side. So I couldn't really tell which side was front and which side was back. That was kind of annoying. So that took me about five minutes extra that normally would not take me. I will say it took me probably a good five extra minutes to put this whole set on since I couldn't tell the back from the bottom, the back from the front on the bottoms and already I'm actually pretty warm. Like this actually gets me pretty warm. I'm actually sort of hot in this. So if you want something that keeps you really warm, I definitely would recommend this set. It does feel nice and cozy and lounging. I would say that this would probably be a better set for like a colder day probably if it's like in the 60s 50s 40s i would definitely wear, be wearing this set and as a, a v-neck like the other one did this one did not come or the pants does not come with pockets it is i believe the pants are slightly shorter than last runs from tmo they're not as long and they are flare can't see but yeah they are flare which is a plus but as far as like practicality again it's just not being able to tell the front from the back on the bottom is very annoying and the top itself is comfortable kind of like a fleecy material and the main reason why I picked a a lounge set like this is because I kept seeing like those lounge sets that a lot of people were buying and like they're trying to find them now at um at Ross and JC no no Ross and um TJ Maxx so it's like the ones that are kind of like this and it's like some of them are just like a little candy on top and it just might be shorts or it might be pants like this and have like the candy on top I'd probably get that more to sleep. This would probably be just more to lounge around in. And I will say there is a tag here that is kind of annoying. And I'm just, yeah, I'm just going to rip this off because I hate when tags are right here and it's just rubbing against my side. It just bugs me so much. The second lounge set from Timu, it didn't have a tag, so... No tags on the side, that's plus, so you don't have to worry about that. So I would say, as far as Timu, it's kind of like, I think it's kind of like a hit or miss. Like, overall, the sizing, for both sets, this is a large. I feel like sizing-wise, at least for the pants, the second set from Timu, it was longer, so that fit better for me. But then again, I also am tall, so that's also something extra that I have to deal with. I would say if you're on the shorter side, it's probably not going to make a difference for you. Like the pants are still probably going to be long enough. But if you're on the taller side, um, I would say just if you're going to get a set from Timu, just expect it to not exactly be super long. And if you're okay with that, then I would definitely recommend just find out the Timu. I don't, this doesn't feel like trash quality. It doesn't feel like it's going to rip in like a month or so I think these will last me like maybe over a year like long time and the one from Amazon I do think that was a good set the only critique that I would say is compared to the one from Timu I don't like that I couldn't find like a flare bottom for the bottoms yeah for the bottoms I couldn't find a flare bottom Pricing wise, I'd say it's about the same. So I'm going to give the win to Timu for this one because mainly because of the bottoms. Now, if you found any of this helpful, if you found <coughs> um, some 
inspiration from this and if any of these bottom sets kind of make you want to buy from Chewy Moon or Amazon go ahead and just share your experience down below if you would like to because I would like to know if maybe you had the same experience if you really liked Amazon more if you really loved Chewy Moon but I'm gonna give the point to yeah I'm gonna give the point to Chewy Moon because overall I think they did slightly better and I will see you in the next video Hey guys, so I just also forgot to mention, don't forget to subscribe, don't, um, yeah, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like this video, share this video, do all that fun stuff. I am trying to get at least 2,000 subscribers within the couple of months, and I need all your help, and also thank you to any new subscribers that I may have gained, I think I got a few, and I love y'all. Welcome here if you're new, and I hope to see your comments down below, and I'll just keep making videos, and I hope you guys like them.